Today, I want to talk to you about something which is fundamental to our overall health and well-being, but is often overlooked, mental health. Mental health is not just an absence of mental disorders. It is a state of mental well-being that enables people to cope with the stresses of life, realize their abilities, learn, and work well. Before the outbreak of COVID-19, one in seven individuals or nearly to 60 million people in WHO Southeast Asia region lived with some mental health condition. The pandemic has worsened the situation. Recognizing the urgency to accelerate action to address mental health, member states adopted the PARO declaration in Bhutan last month, committing to provide universal access to people-centered mental health care and services. We must increase investment in mental health services, especially for primary care. We must establish and strengthen community-based mental health services and integrate mental health and psychological support in all policies. We must develop community-based services capable of achieving universal health coverage for mental health. It is time we transform our attitudes, actions and approaches and create a society free from stigma and discrimination towards mental health. Everyone has a right to mental health and to thrive. There is no health without mental health.